Good evening, everybody. Good evening, and welcome. Uh, well done for turning out on this uh, rather damp December evening for this uh, full council meeting, Froome Town Council. For those of you who don't know me, my name is Toby. I'm the mayor of Froome and also the chairman of the council. Um, if you haven't been to a town council meeting for a while, or in fact this is your first time, then we're doing things slightly differently. So you'll see there isn't a big bank of councillors and the public beyond facing each other. What we're doing is we're trying to get you all together and engaged uh, in a more useful conversation. And there will be a point uh, fairly uh, near the beginning of the meeting where we're going to ask you to do some, um, some specific discussions. Um, there should be at least one town councillor on every table. They will be identified by having uh, a voting card that look like this. With their name on it, can town councillors hold up their voting cards? Thank you very much. So those serve two purposes. Firstly, you can tell who's who, and secondly, you can see who votes which way at, uh, at any point. Um, there are two things that we need to remember. So councillors need to remember to keep an open mind at all times, and everybody needs to remember uh, that councillors are not required to vote with the room or with their table uh, uh, at any particular point. Okay, so what we're going to do now is have a little bit of a group discussion around each of these tables. So if you're sitting at the back, not around the table, can I ask if you want to be part of the discussion to come forward, maybe bring a chair with you. There's plenty of space at the front two tables. Okay, so we're going to do this fairly quickly, and I'm going to ask one of the councillors on each table to feed back at, at the end of each each question. The first question we'd like to ask you is, should Froome Town Council consider becoming a direct provider of well-being services? So, yeah. Okay. So, yeah, all right. So, this, this list at the bottom, working within these areas, should Froome Town Council start providing some of those services directly? Should employ people to provide some of those services? So, in your groups, five minutes or so, and I'll ask to come back with, uh, with an idea with a majority view from each table. Should Froome Town Council be providing those services directly? Go. <laughs> Okay, right, we're going, to, we're going to come back together and I'm going to ask uh, Peter's table at the back there for their view on should the Town Council be a direct provider of wellbeing services? Well, the view is a unanimous no. Okay. Um, and the only other thing which I know particularly an interesting discussion around the table is that the need to do it properly. So, so uh, going down the route of supporting organisations doing things is the way we should be going. Um, but there does need to be a way of ensuring that, that they are uh, coming up with the goods. Uh, well, I think well, the first uh, thing that came out of Eddie's uh, lift was budget. Would we have the budget to do everything ourselves? And then echoing pretty much what Peter said, uh, how effective could it be? But we also talked about we would have to become much more of an enabling body, which uh, this chap over here said, and I quite like that phrase we would enable other people to do it. Um, I think that's as far as we got, really. But we, um, we discussed the, uh, the idea that the council has some sort of overview or gathering information from across a very wide range of providers that already exist and give some sort of feedback and information to see where the gaps are. But, um, yeah, it seems like a bit of a silly question. Um, we ended up talking about the effect that Universal Credit is going to have on... Uh, Lots of people that we know. Um, we help on um, sports development. We've had a hand in helping the creation of the mugger and the support of the tennis courts at the, uh, the, up at the playing fields, the uh, pump track and the playgrounds. So we do get involved in those things, but generally to be the prime provider of those services, the answer is no. 
but help where we can, obviously, and do do. Yeah. Suggestions? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Can I have a proposal for recommendations one and two, please? Uh, Tim and seconded by Nick. And all those in favour? Uh, any against? And any abstentions? Thank you. Majority. Majority.